Behind every fact is a face. Behind every statistic is a story. Behind every slogan is a young person whose future will be lost if something is not done immediately to change their reality. And when it comes to young men like me, the numbers are staggering and the reality is scary. Good afternoon. My name is Brendan McMiller. I'm 14 years old and a freshman at Westside High School. The fact is my mother was only 15 years old when I was born. She was a child herself. She was raising a newborn son in poverty on her own. Working tirelessly, she put her goal of graduating on hold, struggling to find a job that someone would give to a dropout. As she struggled to make ends meet, we moved around a lot, often staying with family and friends because she couldn't afford permanent housing. With each move came a new house, a new school, and hopefully some new friends. But the one constant was my mother's dream. The dream for me to be successful in school. The dream she was not able to fulfill herself. The dream for me to graduate. The statistics, the statistics show that only 78% of African American males will graduate from high school. That number decreases to only 67% of African American males that are born to a parent who dropped out of high school. To some, those numbers might not matter. But to my mother, that 67% was a driving force that pushed her to make tough decisions when it came to raising and providing for her family. In third grade, my mother did something that would immediately change my reality. She enrolled me at the West Side Boys and Girls Club. <laughs> it was then that she knew I would no longer be just a statistic. But I was only eight years old, and I did not want to go to the Boys and Girls Club. I just knew it was going to be like every other place, mean teachers and mean kids. Boy, was I wrong. <laughs> the staff was amazing. They welcomed my mom and me with open arms. They got me involved in programs and made sure I learned two very important things. One, to always bring your membership card. <laughs> Why? Because that is the rule. And two, they taught me my number. Not my phone number or my member number, but the most important number. 2019, the year I will graduate high school. From day one, the club expected that I would graduate. I never felt that I could do it, but with their support, I knew I didn't want to fail them or my mom. As a member of the club for the past seven years, I've been provided with so many opportunities to make a difference. I've been a junior staff, a reading mentor, and I've led so many community service projects. I learned leadership skills in, in Keystone Club, and in 2015, I was elected president by my peers. As the current Keystone president, I am proud to say that this is our first year our Keystone Club has raised enough money to take a summer Keystone trip. Behind every fact is a face. I am Brandon McMiller. Behind every statistic is a story. This is my story. Behind every slogan is a young person whose future will be lost if something is not done to change the reality. The club changed my reality. And without it, nothing will stand in the way of me accomplishing my slogan, my number. Two thousand nineteen. Thank you. Thank you.